Tips on how to handle abusive relationships. A relationship is a very valuable aspect in our life. It must be unique and something to be enjoyed by everyone. We all dream of having a very healthy relationship especially with our friends, family members and loved ones. It is a relationship wherein we enjoy each other's company. We do things together like watching a basketball game or sometimes with the company of some friends. We are honest about our feelings with each other. There is mutual respect and sincerity between the two of us. It means we pay attention to each other's opinion or thoughts. Always trying to reach out to each other to strengthen the bonds of the relationship. On the other hand, to have an unhealthy or abusive relationship is to experience the exact opposite when we are having a healthy relationship. We usually feel bad about ourselves. We do not verbalize our feelings. We take each other for granted. It could be in the form of hurting the other person verbally, abusing the person physically, emotional abuse and sexual abuse. Sometimes, both of them will be violent or be abusive to each other. There are situations wherein only one is abusive to the other. Most often, the abusive relationship does not happen immediately only after some time. That will be the manifestation of the real self of the person you promised to live with. If we are experiencing an abusive relationship, then how are we to get out from such relationship? First and foremost, we need to talk to somebody we could trust, like for example our parents, a friend, guardian, counselor, teacher or a doctor. We should relate to them that we are having an unhealthy relationship and what the other person did so as to abuse us. If we are afraid to tell our parents, then we should approach somebody whom we trust to help us in telling our parents, to the counselor, security of the school, and even the police about the abuse. And we will be able to escape such relationship. In leaving an abusive relationship, sometimes it is too risky to do so. There is a necessity for us to make a plan for our safety so that everything will be done smoothly. It will surely not be difficult and safer if we will have a plan. These are the tips for our safety plan. Thank you for watching.